You know, co-founder and former CEO of Twitter, Jack Dorsey's first tweet was converted to a NFT last year and is sold for $2.9 million. Is this a joke? No, it's no joke. In reality, digital artworks are witnessing great rise in value in NFT marketplace. Recently, an American artist, Beeple, sold his digital art in the form of NFT for the whopping $69 million. There are many such news stories are coming every day where people are earning well by selling NFTs of the digital assets. Yes, NFT is getting popular and the artwork are fetching such a huge price which was impossible earlier. Yes, NFT is getting more mainstream acceptance. So don't you think that you should know about it? So in this video, I'm going to talk about what is an NFT? How does NFT work? Why is NFT getting so popular? Should we invest in an NFT, best NFT marketplace, etc. So stay tuned till the end of the video. And if you like the video, don't forget to like it and subscribe for more videos. Now, NFT means non-fungible tokens. Now, what is this non-fungible? Suppose you have a note of rupees 2000. You can go to a shop and exchange that note with four notes of 500 rupees. Or you can exchange the note with any other note with similar value. Yes, physical currency can be exchanged for one another, so it is fungible in nature. Now, suppose you have a book and your friend has also got the same book. You can easily interchange the book with your friend. Now, suppose Sachin Tendulkar or Amitabh Bachchan gives an autograph on the book that you have. Now, would you like to exchange that book with anyone? Absolutely not. It becomes so important and unique for you. The book has become non-fungible for you, meaning you won't like to interchange it. Now coming to token, it is nothing but proof of ownership. When someone buys a house, a sale agreement is signed between the buyer and the seller. And once verified by the lawyer or registrar, the sales agreement is the sale agreement is registered to have legal validity. Then it becomes proof of ownership of the property. Similarly, NFT is a digital asset such as art, music, games, etc. with an authentic certificate with valuable information stored in it, just like agreement document. And it comes with digital signature that makes it unique. So it is non-fungible and can neither be replaced or interchanged because it has unique properties. It is created by blockchain technology. And since it is created by blockchain technology, you can only exchange NFT with cryptocurrencies. As you know, there is no physical currency in the world of blockchain. So NFT relies on cryptocurrencies for exchange. And because it uses blockchain and cryptocurrencies, they say that it is it cannot be forced or manipulated. I've already created a video on blockchain. If you want to know about blockchain, you can go through it. In short, a blockchain is an online ledger where transactions are noted and verified by members and not by any central authority. The transactions are recorded over many computers and verified by all the computers and not by one entity. So it is impossible to manipulate the transaction and no one can make changes in the record. Like in a banking system, a bank records and verifies all your transactions. A bank acts as a central authority which controls your money. The transactions can be manipulated there. But in a blockchain technology, no one person or entity controls the blockchain. You can make those transfers without traditional middleman. And this makes transfer secure and almost immediate. So NFTs are powered by blockchain technologies and the distributed nature of blockchain makes NFTs nearly impossible to hack. Yes, NFTs provide unique, verifiable, and immutable proof of ownership of digital assets. And you know what? Some of the NFTs have been sold for millions of dollars. As a result, they are getting very popular. With NFTs, people are selling digital items and the sale and ownership is tracked using blockchain technology. You can buy or sell the digital assets like music, games, paint, etc. in the form of NFTs on various platforms. You know, there are companies who take license of picture, videos, songs from celebrities. They create NFTs and sell them. Some of the most popular and well-rated NFT marketplaces where you can buy or sell these 
digital assets are OpenSea, Rarible, and SuperAir. And if you are a content creator, you can also take proof of ownership of your content by creating NFT and sell them. So it has created a separate marketplace where you can buy and sell digital assets. And the best part is that the marketplace is quite secured and you can earn big. And yes, NFTs are a great way to invest. They can be a great investment because you can resell them for profit. So should we invest in NFTs? I would say it is risky at the moment. They are still evolving. So let them gain mainstream acceptance first. It is still a highly unregulated market. But you can experience buying and selling of NFTs. It is a new technology, so you should experience it. If you can create something digitally, create NFTs and try to sell or buy just for experience. You know, in early days of mobile phones, we were all very excited to use it and experience it. Similarly, the marketplace of NFT is new, but it can become our future. So why not experience it now? That's all about NFTs. I hope you find this video helpful. Thank you and see you next time.